Can you guys see anything strange about this base? Unless I do this. Oh, this is it. Stand your ground, right there. All right, so hello everyone, Fudgy here, and welcome back to another Gmod Dark RP video. All right, so my plan for this video is to once again hide my money printers. As you guys know, I'm always looking for ways to hide my stuff. That way, if I get raided, hopefully no one will be able to find my money printers. But what I really want to do is make a wall. Now, this wall will look like the normal wall, if that makes sense, in the base. I've chosen a base around the corner, uh, the one I was just at a minute ago. But before I go ahead and start building the base, I need to go and get a gun license because the last thing I want is police knocking on my door and then them having a reason to arrest me if I have my gun out. Also, ever since they changed the map, uh, they've changed it once again. And I'm getting like a bunch of error messages around here. And also, I keep lagging around. Oh, it's beautiful. All right, copyright. Look at this, the Christmas workshop. Well, that was great. Let's go. All right, the chief of police should be on his way. And that way, we'll be able to get our gun license and start building the base. Ah, here he is. Let's go ahead and request oh, a gun license. 1,000. There we go. Yes, he's grotted it. All right, thanks a lot, man. Have a good day. All right, nice. Let's go make this base. So yeah, I've decided that I want to make it here. I've already claimed all the doors. Now, let me explain a little bit what my plan actually is. So right here, this is where I want to have the money printers. Now, the money printers come to about here, I would say, uh, when I spawn them in. But what I'm going to do is try my best to try and mimic this wall right here, but push it to this way this far out if that makes sense and then we can have it as a fading door now i really do not know if this is gonna work this is my first time doing it so um we'll just have to wait and see now obviously i do not want to get raided while i'm doing this so first things first of course we need to put the building sign up all right there we go for some reason it wouldn't place up there but yep that's very obvious that i'm building now let's lock this door Right, I have to try and make this as convincing as possible. Right, this is going to be a little bit difficult on this server because there's no precision tool. So this is going to make things a little bit awkward. But you can kind of see what I'm going for here. I have to find a material that matches this and this. So uh, yeah, it might just be a case of using the same material and then changing the bottom one, the color. All right, I've just had an idea. We can use this. As reference, if it works. Oh, no, you can't use them. <laughs> no. I was going to use them for the money printer reference, but you can't spawn them in. Oh, we got a match. Yes. All right. That looks pretty good. Actually, it might just be a little too short on this end. I'm kind of worried about someone being outside. Even though I have a building sign up, I, I, I still want to see what is going on. All right. There we go. That's a pretty good view right there. All right. I actually can't wait to see if this works or not. Now, I have a feeling that the hardest part about this might be finding the material that is perfect. That's actually not too bad, right? I have a feeling I might just get away with this. There's going to be some really smart people out there who are going to realize that it's a fake wall straight away. But to be honest, it doesn't matter if it's that obvious. It means it's just an extra like way of protecting your printers anyway. So yeah. Ooh, look at this. We've got to find the perfect color. Oh, that's pretty good. All right, there we go. We've almost completed the fake wall already. That's actually pretty convincing. Let me know what you think of that in the comment section down below. I feel like if I had better tools such as precision, like I said, we can't use that on this server, which is really annoying. Yeah. Sorry, you cannot use precision. Oh, you know what? Do one, mate. Uh, but yeah, we can use the stacker and advanced duplicator, which are great tools. But we need a little bit more for this, this project we're doing. Probably should have chosen a different server to do this on. But yeah, we're doing it anyway. That's actually really convincing. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. This is so good. And oh, man, does the stacker give it away? I think it does. If we stack them up, it kind of has this like black bar at the top. That's not good. I don't know. I feel like at first glance, people just won't realize. Maybe we add some props around here as well, just to make it look a little bit less, I don't know, like messed up, I guess. Like what if we just added like stuff like this? So it looks like it was against the wall. All right. So as a further decoy to anyone that tries to raid me, I'm going to go ahead and add a money printing rack. Now, what this should do is when people raid me, They'll see this and think, huh, that's kind of strange. Why is there no money printers? Um, and, and that's because they're going to be on the other side of this wall here. 
All right, so I'm also going to put the camera right there. All right, so actually, before I continue with this room here, I'm going to quickly make a fading door in the entrance just to make this base a little bit better protected, and that way we can defend it a lot more easy as well. Now, while I'm doing this, I want to let you guys know that there will be more Dark RP content coming out very soon. So if you do want to see that, make sure to leave a like and, of course, subscribe if you haven't already. Now, in the future, I'm actually planning on building or attempting to build an unraidable base. And I think I'm going to use some of the similar stuff that I, I would do in that video. Um, also in this one, just to see if they work okay. So yeah, there's currently a lot of people walking above me. And there's also someone living right next door. So it's important I have nothing clipping through. I believe the guy owns a gun shop. All right, so as you can see right here, this is something that's been going on in Gary's Mod for a long time now. It's having a very small area to shoot out of, just like this one. Now, I think this is a really, really awesome idea. I also need to go ahead and add something I can actually stand on, like a platform. So if we add this right here... Now, this should be almost the perfect height to shoot from. So, yeah, if anyone tries raiding me through here, I have all this area to shoot out of, and I'll also make a platform here. Now, the only downside to it, of course, is that they can shoot me back. However, it will be a lot more difficult for them to shoot me. Now, I could probably make this gap even smaller, but we'll leave it like that for now. So, yeah, like I was saying earlier, if I build a base which is unraidable, I think I'm going to incorporate this into that base. I mean, so far, this base is uh, coming along pretty nicely, I must say. Oh, and by the way, the reason this couch is here is because I'm hiding this, which is obviously part of this part here. It kind of went through the wall. And we don't want to give away anything, so I decided to put a couch there. Perfect. Someone's outside my base. Who is this guy? What does he want? All right, I know it looks ugly right now, but... You know, it serves a purpose, and it should help us out a lot when the time comes when we get raided, because, let's face it, it's probably gonna happen. Oh man, I really am going all in on this base. <laughs> I'm uh, adding a lot of cover points, as well as the little gap there, and I'm also gonna add a tiny little window, so I'll be able to see where they are. And to make my life a little bit more easy, I am just gonna weld them together, and then do this. There we go. So yeah, if this little gap doesn't work out and I need to run somewhere, I can just take cover behind here and then see if they enter the base. All right, well, I think I've actually done this pretty quickly. I, I don't really want to focus too much on the entrance anyway, so I think we should get back to work on the main part of the base, which of course is the fake wall right here. Now, there is still a gap, which is really annoying me, but I don't know if we can fix it or not. I mean, I'll do my best. Oh yeah, we also have another cover point right here, so... If anyone comes to my base, I just straight up shoot him like that. There might be a better material than what I have, by the way. I should really look. There's a slight gap. Oh, man, we need precision. Oh, look. Well, that kind of works. Although it has this weird kind of, I don't know. You can see the textures are going a bit weird, how they've collided together. I forget the name of it now. But then what we could do is get the weld, remove it, and then the slightest push might fix that. Oh, ho, ho. Yes. All right, it's still bothering me how there's a gap right there. Oh, I know what we could do. We could add some sort of prop, like a lamp. Yes, you lamp. You go here and cover up that corner. We just need to make it look less obvious, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Would you guys know that that's a fake wall right there? I think I've done a pretty good job right there. I'm actually really happy with the way this is turning out. Oh, I just realized, though, if you sit down, you can actually look through. Look at that. Oh, that's not good. That means if anyone comes into my base, decides to sit down for whatever reason, they can use this to look through. I hope they don't do that. Oh, look at this. We're on the other side now. I sat down somewhere and now I'm stuck. Oh, look, I can see everything. There's only one thing we can do, and that is holster our weapon and do this. Yep, that should do the trick. Oh, man. <laughs> If anyone came to my base right now, they just see like a pair of legs dangling from the ceiling. All right, you know what? I'm happy with the progress we've made with this base, and I think I can probably defend it pretty well. So, I reckon we should go ahead and get the money printers in right now. Actually, wait, before I do that, I need to turn into a fading door. All right, well, there we go. We are now ready to remove the building sign. All right, so what I've done is added these two boxes. I decided to put a deagle in here. Not sure why but yeah these are both activated by these right here these keypads now they do actually work however the real one for this wall is hidden behind here which you can actually access by the way right here 
Uh, I might need to make it a little bit more easy to access because it could be a little bit unfair. And also, we need to no collide this because, <laughs> well, we're going to need to get into that wall there. But yeah, there you go. You can now access this keypad and we can also get into the wall. It's got to work, right? Surely. No one's going to know that's a fake wall. I mean, they probably will. Oh, no. Why is there someone at my door? I was literally just about to get the money printers in. And now there's someone here just banging on my door. What is he playing at? Okay, he's gone. He's gone. Right, we're good. Gold printer, diamond, we're going all in. We're pretty much getting them all. Oh my goodness. Yes, look at this. All right, I probably should have spawned them in this side. All right, there we go. All money printers are now hidden in the fake wall. And you ready? There it is. All right, nice. And remove. All right, someone's had their eye on this base, a thief. So we've got to be careful. I feel like he's literally waiting for me to remove the building sign. All right, we're buying another camera. Whoa, look at that. It's a balancing act. Oh, look at that. We're doing okay as well. This is good. Oh, he's in. He's in. The guy's in my base. Hello. What are you doing here, boy? Get out of my base. Wait, right here. What are you doing? <laughs> he just shows up all the time. Oops. Hey, come on in, dude. Sorry for shooting you, man. <laughs> Welcome. Hey, I need your honest opinion. And also, I need you to PM me if you, um, well, figure something out. Follow me. Right, we're gonna we're gonna show him my base and we're gonna see if he can see what's wrong with it. Welcome. Right, let's see if he figures out where my money printers actually are. Alright, he hasn't actually figured it out yet. He's noticed there's a weapon there. But Raiden knows me very well and he knows that I like to hide my printers and stuff. Alright, is he about to figure it out? I think he might have. Raiden's very smart, so we'll see. Yeah, look, he's right. This place is hiding something. <laughs> he said that in chat. I don't wanna speak too loudly because I'm worried people around me are going to be able to hear that i'm hiding something in here no my wardrobe all right so he hasn't figured it out yet he's been in here for a couple of minutes now still nothing yeah i'll tell you what reina you make this place look nice okay since you have all the cool props and stuff i'm also going to give you access to the doors all right i trust you so you really can't figure it out right no okay well watch this there you go <laughs> There we go. I revealed it to him. You seriously had no idea, right? <laughs> oh, that's amazing. That just proves it works. He likes it. So this that's why I have to keep a lot of this stuff around here. Now, also, if you look around here, yeah, that's that's how he said he likes it a lot. All right, cool. But yeah, like I was saying earlier, I often do this stuff in Dark RP. So if you do enjoy this kind of stuff, make sure you are subscribed. That way, when I upload, you'll be able to see it. I don't know what Raider's doing. He's showing me something. Not allowed. Oh, I knew it was going to be breaking the rules or something. The gap is too small. This is against the rules. All right, so if anyone's going to join this server, yeah, don't do this. Oh, my bad. It needs to be bigger than a keypad. At least I know for next time. Sometimes I dream about cheese. Raina, do you want one in here? Is it like a decoy? Put the silver one in here, maybe? That way, they know we have printers, but there's the silver one in there, which isn't very good, so it doesn't matter too much. All right, there we go. KOS inside. Um, yeah, I'm almost trying to bait people to raid me, if I'm honest, because I just want to see how well the secret wall actually holds up. I mean, Rainer had absolutely no idea until I showed him, so I am very confident in this. <gasps> a voice reveal. Rainer is finally going to reveal his voice. Here we go. The moment we've all been waiting for. I've been playing with Rainier for a long time now. I've never heard it. No one else has heard it before. And here we go. What the? What was that? Is that your dog barking? Uh. Oh, here we go. This could be it. For real this time. <laughs> he just sniffed his mic. <gasps> I heard it a little bit. Do it again. Okay, this is my first one. Right there. Oh my goodness. Although you're using a, uh, a voice changer. So it's not your real voice. I'm disappointed. Well, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Rainier, um, sort of voice reveal with a voice changer. So technically not his voice. Oh, okay. Whoa, 58K. Oh man, we are making some serious money today. Scared. All right, here we go. Match bet and flip. Me and Rainer, we're doing a coin flip. Let's see who wins. Here we go. Come on. I need to win this. Come on. Yes. I did it. I won. <laughs> nice, dude. All right, let's see how much money these have made now. Let's see what we on. Oh, yes. Nearly 60K for the Sapphire printer. 
Oh my, I am making so much cash from this right now. Look at that. <laughs> oh no, someone's there. I think they can probably see in. The mayor's outside my house. What is he doing? Oh, some sort of transaction's going down over here. He might be getting a gun license. All right, let's go. Operation save the mayor, apparently. The mayor's been kidnapped. All right, they went this way. What are you doing? Kill him. Mayor, are you okay? Shoot us, you're going to die. Remember that oh. if you shoot us, Oh, Raiders right say if he shoots us, he's gonna die. I don't know what's Kill. happening right now. Kill. Yes. I got him, dude. Target Thank down. You. I was being... You're saved. You're saved, man. Whoa, it's happening. It's happening. We're being raided. Oh. This is it. This is it. Stand your ground, Rainer. Stand your ground. Okay, this is it. They got a bubble shield down, which is never good. Even if they get in it, they might not be able to find the uh, the printers. All right, they're in, I think. Can they open the door? Yeah, they have. There's a shield there, so we can't do anything anyway. Oh, this is it. Stand your ground, Rainer. Oh, here we go. Oh, they froze. Oh, no, 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 no. Rainer, fall back. Pull back. Oh, these shields are just OP. All right, let's check the cameras. Uh, they're about to uh, get through to the last door now, pretty much, other than the fake wall. We've made so much money in this video, so if they break through and actually get the printers, it's all good. And now there's a homeless guy living outside as well. Suppress. We can shoot through walls. Oh, I've been shot a little bit. Not good. Oh, they're there. They're there. Come on. Come on. If we check the cameras. Oh, no. There, 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 there. Where is he? Where is he on the camera? Oh, they're in the shield. The final stand. The final stand. I'm going to pop up and shotgun them in the face. Shoot through the wall. Oh, I'm nearly dead. I'm so close to dying right now. Oh, they've put down another shield. How many of these shields do they have? Look, there's nothing we can do. Nice knowing you, buddy. This is it. The final stand. As soon as he gets through that shield, I should be able to pop up and shoot him in the face. Oh, here we go. They're in. Come on, come on. Just stay here. Just stay here. What? How did he see me? I'm down. I'm down. We're both dead. We knew that was going to happen. Like I said, I've made enough money. They just try to get into uh, the decoy. They have no idea there's a fake wall there. Oh, look, they got the silver printer. No one cares, though. Oh, and they blew it up. The guy that actually raided us was a head admin. Um, so <laughs> that kind of sucks. But yeah, this was more of a, like a tutorial. If you want to do this yourself, I always recommend that you hide your printers. And to be fair, it really did work today. And I thought it went really well. And I'll definitely be doing more stuff like this very soon. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this one. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. And I shall see you in the next one. Goodbye.